a marketing rebel. A marketing rebel. All right, here we are with another Digital Dose segment with Austin Rutherford. And you ready for this, Austin? Let's do it. All right. So what are the, your top book recommendations, business, marketing, or money that every entrepreneur should read? Absolutely. So Think and Grow Rich uh, is a book that changed my life at 19 years old. So highly, highly recommend that. Um, I'm actually reading a book right now. It's called A Pocket Full of Money. Um, it puts a lot of things in life into perspective. So uh, on my last chapter today, um, so definitely recommend that as well. It's been a great book. Um, and uh, the book by Tim Grover. Oh, what's the book? Um, Relentless? Yes. Relentlessness by Tim Grover uh, was a good book as well. Yeah, that was phenomenal. It was a good one. I, gotta, I don't have a pocket full of money. I got to pick that one up. Great book. Um, all right. So what is one software app or tool that you cannot live without inside of your life or business? Um, my calendar. You know, I, all my meetings are booked on there. My phone calls are booked on there. Time to spend with my family is booked on there. Um, it's it, If you try and go and like just remember things, you're going to forget 100%. So I, I live by my calendar. Nice. And uh, yeah, I want to point out what you just said. Even your family time is booked on there. Right. Yep. And I think what happens is sometimes when you don't leverage the proper time and block the time and then it's if it's not blocked out, it doesn't get get done sometimes. So sure. um, what is the best investment you ever made for yourself outside of outside of yourself? Because a lot of I, entrepreneurs will always say, I'm going gonna, I'm gonna to invest in me. Investing in me is always the best thing. Right. We know <laughs> that. That's number one. So what's the second best investment you ever made? Yeah, that, that was going to be my answer. Um, <laughs> so, so, so two things, right? So real estate's created the most millionaires ever. Um, I have, you know, an okay uh, real estate portfolio, almost 100 units now. So I think that's going to continue to create wealth into the future. Um, it's, it's a safe bet, right? You know, you're not going to 100 extra money, but it's, it's going to be safe. Um, but cryptocurrencies, I think, got into it about a year ago, um, made a lot of money. It's been phenomenal. And I think it's going to continue to go on and, and become great and make a lot more money. Um, so definitely, uh, thus far, it's been great. We'll see how it turns out in a couple of years. All right. So I'm with you on that. It's going to be great. Speak it <laughs> into existence. So uh, what is one, what is one thing you would tell your younger self when getting started in business now? Speak up. You know, I, I, I would never, I was very nervous. I was very shy. Like we'd go to school dances and I would literally be the kids in the, in, in the corner standing there because I didn't want to dance and embarrass myself. I didn't want to talk to somebody and, and choke on my words. Um, and now, like, I talk to everybody, like everybody I walk past, everybody I see, everybody I stand in the elevator with, like I'm creating some sort of conversation and closed mouths don't get fed. That's a very, very real thing. So uh, I wish I would have told myself, I wish back then I was more outgoing and I would have forced myself out of my comfort zone to actually talk and network with people. That's huge, man. That's I'm, I was very similar. So yeah, that's huge. And closed mouths don't get fed. Right, so right. Um, awesome, man. Thank you for uh, jumping on the digital dose. Appreciate it. Absolutely, brother. I'm a marketing rebel. Marketing rebel.